guys, look at this. This is just breathtaking. What are you doing on your Thursday? Are you winning? This is the most expensive real estate in the world right now. Those homes right up there. That's where they are. That pocket. This pocket of real estate is the most expensive real estate in the world. Most expensive in Canada, that's for sure. See those mountains right there. Look at that bridge. Alright guys, this is Rich from Wish To Be Live. Thanks, stay alive. Well, Mr. Catan takes me for a walk, and we've been walking for three hours now. We've walked about six kilometers. So that's about uh, three and a half miles. And it's totally against my will, and I got the wrong shoes. And we we're behind this really big rock here. And our buddy's trying to meet us, but I'm thinking the only way he's going to be able to get to us is if he can scale this really big rock here. Look at this. It's crazy. You guys see this? Look at the size of this rock. I don't know how to get around this rock I don't know how we're gonna get around it it's very big and apparently my friend is on his way Mr. Katam has got us in a pickle here and uh, apparently Mr. Katam is saying he wants to climb this rock here but I don't believe him Look at him, he's walking away. It's all talk. He's not going up there. So what's going on? There's a gentleman over here that uh, was walking the seawall here with his mother about two months ago and she dropped her phone in the water. And now he's in there looking for it. Wow. Do you guys believe this? Do you believe this story? I don't know if I believe this story, folks. Let's see. No, but look, there's a man. Oh my goodness, it's true. There's a man searching. <laughs> <laughs> It's cold down there. I bet. <laughs> you don't think the current would have carried it out? It may have. Might have. By the way things are moving down there, I'm thinking it's pretty likely. Yeah. <laughs> well, best of luck, man. Yeah. As soon as it gets in like five or six. That sucks. Yeah. Would have been nice when it's still sunny for you. Yeah. You, you would think it would just sink, you know? No. It's like there's lots of like stuff flopping around too. It's really hard to like... Calvary, yeah. yeah. Tough one. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't get too cold. <laughs> well, you gave it 100%, that's for sure. <laughs> so, Mr. Katam takes me on a walk, tells me it's only going to be 20 minutes. It's been 3 hours and 15 minutes. He's telling me the road is just right up there. Oh, yeah. Right up there, guys. Just right there. No problem. Let me just scale this huge rock. And this is what he's done to me. I've been stuck here for three hours and 15 minutes walking. Maybe the thing is three hours and 15 minutes. This is so slow. Three hours and 15 minutes. This guy has got me stuck on a walk. When I could be making videos and being productive, this guy has me walking for three hours and 15 minutes on a Thursday. What seemed like a great idea has turned into my nightmare. 
my feet are really sore. My right foot especially is really hurting. And uh, Mr. Katam just thinks it's funny. He just laughs with his long locks and curly hair. He just laughs, thinks it's just a big, a big joke. Meanwhile, I'm sitting here struggling away, trying to find civilization. And uh, yeah, I've been walking for, like I said, three hours and 15 minutes straight. I usually don't do that much walking.